Hello and welcome back to the channel. In today's video, I thought I'd show you a English Civil War table setup that we're going to be playing a scenario for tomorrow. Um, why English Civil War? Well, it's funny actually. Um, I hadn't played with these figures since 2016 when I had my breakdown, before, just before my breakdown. Um, and I was going to do a World War II game to celebrate, obviously, the VE celebrations for tomorrow. Um, but whilst sort of getting my figures out, I'd come across these and I thought, ah, why not have these instead? Like, you know, it's a bit of fun. Um, rules wise, I'm going to use is Pike and Shot by Warlord Games. Um, just again, just a bit of fun, really. Um, so I'll go through the armies and that. The game is loosely based upon a um, 1648. Uh, whereas Cromwell and the Army of um, Northern Association and the New Model Army goes to uh, take on a combined Scottish force. But like I said, this is just a fictitious scenario, but around those sort of idea. I'll show you the armies in a minute. So over here, we've got some Dragoons. I'm getting a bit closer. Um, and then to the next is Crassier unit. And then we have Pike and Shot unit. Uh, most of the figures on the table will be Warlord Games. There's a few odd ones. Over the back there's a Commander there. That's Spike or Miniatures. Those do some absolutely exquisite um, command figures. Cromwell at the back there. This unit here is by uh, Empress Miniatures. Metal figures. They're really nice. Um, everything else, most of this stuff is all plastic. We've got a Saker Cannon there. Another Pike and Shot unit. leader, some lobster cavalry, and another dragoon unit. The dragoon units are attached to the infantry, and then obviously each squadron of the uh, squadron here, there's two squadrons there, and by that are commanded by that leader, and the same with the cuirassiers, two squadrons or troops, um, commanded by the leader there. So I'll spin the camera around and I'll show you the uh, Scots forces. So we start off here with some Lancer Cavalry. I do like the old uh, Scots Cavalry. They're more like sort of like on like little ponies and that. Really nice figures and that there. Um, and then next to them we have a Covenantry unit, Pike and Shot. Another one next to those. So we get down. Again, all Warlord Games. Leader there at the back there by Bicorn. Same with that one there. Little frame gun, I do like the frame gun. Um, a pike and shot unit in the centre here. Oops, better uh, re uh, put him back into place. There we go. Um, Lord Levin behind him. And just some other figures we've got for the Royalist Army, which we've got a base up. Again, these, as I said, got some of these out. I forgot these need a lot of these need a base nut, but I was sort of eager to get them on the table to play them and that. So you'd have to excuse me for that, naughty boy that I am. Um, and some sort of galloper cavalry there, commanded by the leader at the back there. There we are. So there we have it. So as I said, a little table overview of a quick sort of ECW game. So uh, don't know if we're going to film it or not yet um there's a few things going on tomorrow but we're going to sort of try and get this game in as we're playing so there we have it then thanks a lot and uh catch you next time